have to prove they're fleeing persecution because of their nationality, race, religion, political views, or membership in a social group. New data from U.S. Customs and Border Protection highlight the dangers of agents faced while working on the front lines between last October and April of this year. There have been 207 assaults on agents. 49 of those happen in the El Paso sector. When it comes to types of assaults, this includes physical, throwing rocks, and using vehicles. In your community news this morning, if you love to read, then Danielle's got an event that you can go and meet local authors. I know this is pretty cool. And guess what? All the all the authors are going to be there to give us the inside scoop on how they came up with their books. That's awesome. I know we don't normally get that opportunity. No, we don't. We it, really don't. It's going to be pretty cool. Uh, be thinking of what you want them to write in the book. OK, OK, right. <laughs> something about greatness. And we'll, we'll go from there. Oh, you, you, that's all like a plan, Jeremiah. Look, you guys be thinking about it, too, because you're going to get your books signed as well. I'm really excited about this because it's going to be such a fun event. OK, uh, professional author Sandra Elise. Rodriguez is going to be on site and she actually is the creator of the book Rise and Shine, which is a self-help type of journal meant to really help readers lead the best lives possible. Okay, it's meant to empower, inspire and motivate as well as shine a light on the power of positivity, good lifestyle habits and overall mental wellness. I love that. We're going to be able to meet and greet with her, ask her any questions we might have about her book writing process uh, and of course learn uh, some of the ins and outs when it comes to what it takes uh, to make this type of uh, a piece of literature possible. So we're going to do that. Also learn about uh, some of her challenges faced as well as, of course, get our, our own copy of the journal personally signed by her. Uh, there's going to be other special guests on site, which is uh, great for all book lovers, like Jeremiah said, because this is our chance to possibly meet with uh, other authors uh, from here in the 956 region uh, specifically. So it's going to be a good time. Now, the event is taking place at uh, guys. Help me out with this. How do you put uh, you got it? Just go ahead. Bookstore. All right. You <laughs> Yeah. Uh, and uh, like I said, all you need to know really is that it's located off of Main Street in McAllen. Uh, it's happening from 530 to 7 in the evening. So uh, we do hope you're able to make it on out there. And you can visit allevents.inmcallen for registration info, plus a full list of all that you can expect to see out there on that date. Guys, we may not know how to pronounce that French word, mm -hmm. uh, but we do know how to pronounce the name of the book, Rise and Shine. And I love positive stuff. Oh, this yes. is great. It's very good. Yeah. I know. This definitely sounds good like message. a book you'd like to mm -hmm. read. Yes. I think that everybody could probably learn something uh, no matter what your your I just want to say you know outlook on life yeah. your your religion <laughs> what you believe mm -hmm. politics yeah. I would like to think that anyone can gather something from a self-help book like this yeah. it just helps you kind of kind of reframe your mind to think positively mm -hmm. so. and what's really cool is that you get to meet the author you get to meet the yeah. person who came up with the idea the mission their goal their yeah. theme and you know you can kind of inspire off of that as well yeah and you know they probably have challenges as we all have so it's really cool to see them persevere mm -hmm. so pretty good stuff there. When you said the name of the book, it's like Rise and Shine. Rise and Shine. Rise and Shine. Rise and Shine. Shine. Rise and shine. Aww, I don't Little know Kylie Jenner. Oh. No. You don't know oh, that meme? Oh, yes, I Rise do. The meme? Shine. Okay, oh, yeah. yes, I remember. <laughs> you know what you can do today when you're Rise and Shine? Look okay. at the sun shining? Maybe eat, eat something. Oh. oh, yeah. Waffles. Oh. Waffle Wednesday? Pick me up, Waffle, Waffle Wednesday. Wednesday. Can I? Like can we? Can we start this? Oh yeah, 92 at noon, guys. We don't have a heat advisory today so far, but don't think for a second it means it's going to be a beautiful rainy day. Uh, we're still going to feel like we're in the hundreds by noon to 1 p.m. So you will not need your rain jacket starting.